I'm back. I'm super excited. I'm going to show you guys all the parts that I was waiting for. I ordered a lot more parts, but these parts are definitely key components to me being able to put the swap together and bring the car over to the garage and start, you know, messing with the measurements, taking out the old swap and playing around and getting an idea of all the custom mounts and everything that I have to do. So let me show you the parts. I have the ACT clutch and pressure plate. You see what the pressure plate down there. Clutch. They say that the flywheel, the K Miata flywheel came with this. This is a throwout bearing. The release throwout bearing. The clutch centerpiece. This is the beautiful flywheel from K Miata. They brought they gave the screws. This thing, this thing is a little heavy, but it definitely looks good, guys. Definitely, definitely looks good. Came with the throttle bearing installed. That helps. Saves me some problems. It saves me a headache. <sighs> kind of heavy. Sorry, it's a little hard to get all this done with one hand. But yep, came with the screws. Oh yes, um, I didn't fully read the specs and instructions when ordering because I was so hyped. But you need to order flywheel bolts. These flywheel bolts, I order them specifically from Honda OEM for uh, basically any J series, any Accord or Acura TL that has a five speed or six speed transmission. These flywheel bolts are longer than the stock ones. I'll put a picture in the video to show you the stock TSX bolts. And here we have more. And here's the plate. They brought, you know, thank you for your business, a sticker. I'm guessing those are M&Ms. Hmm. I'm not too sure if I'll eat those, but some, some pins to guide. Hardware. And here you go. Not heavy, super, super strong, feel strong. It has the little K Miata sign. But yeah, guys, now I'm going to be putting, mating the transmission. I'm going to put all this together and show you guys that I'm going to definitely get on video, show you guys anything that I encounter. From what I was reading, I'm going to have to notch my transmission for the starter due to the fact that the Miata trans like the starter for the Miata is a different system than the Honda's but yep that's it guys